with what I saw in the Miss Paros. Uh, and I very encourage you to, you know, when you, when you hear about academy, it's not all about football. It's about uh, getting the right age and the right structure on the ground. And with what, with what I saw here in Jaws, I'm very, very impressed with it. You see, you don't, to, you don't need to rush on things. It's a greater thing. And with the greater, with the greater thing I saw on the ground, uh, it is uh, more interesting. I first saw them on Wednesday when I came in. Look, uh, yeah, the, uh, the, the first one that they, they have in the NTA there. And yesterday too, I saw them too, the way they do their training. They finish it with under on the, on the 13th. But what, and again, the game they play today, I mean, the communication with the team is very important. I mean, there's no doubt if they focus on their own life, what, what they, are, what they are going to be for future. I'm, I'm the way they go now, and the, the, the kind of thing they are passing through now, it's well encouraging. Miss Palace, they own their own way to do things. If you are, if you are using to comparison, that's where you are missing some things. Just do your thing the way it's supposed to be, and as a professional level, you get where you are going. You can see the difference between Miss Palace against the team they play today. See, see the kind of just they put on compared to the other team. So that one alone is a, is a plus to the team. Mostly the points I want to make here today is about the coach, their coach under 10 coach, the way you really with the players. It's very, it's like a father and the talk to the children, to the children. And the response to the to the coach is encouraging. So with this, is uh, the sky is at the limit.